And now it's time for the children's moment. So if you've got kids or youth nearby, go ahead. Josh, Josh, hurry up. I'm going to be late. Yeah, go ahead and call those uh, kids over. Josh, Josh, I'm sorry. He is so slow. <laughs> hey, guys, I'm Pastor David, uh, one of the associate pastors here at Wrightsville United Methodist Church. And it's my joy to bring the children's message today. And I've got my friend Josh here helping me. Actually, this is one of my favorite Halloween costumes. And you know what's coming up this week. That's right, Halloween. And are we all excited about that? And uh, many of us will be going either trick-or-treating or trunk-or-treating, trunk or and uh, we'll dress up. So what are, what are some of your favorite costumes? Okay, uh, an astronaut. Hey, that's, man, that is out of this world. <laughs> um, all right, somebody else. A dinosaur. Mm, I'd like to see that. Uh, somebody, a superhero. Which one? Spider-Man, yep, one of my personal favorites. And, and what about you? Uh, Disney Princess? Or which one? Uh, uh, Elsa? Cool. <laughs> All right, so, yeah, we dress up in costumes on Halloween. Do you know why we do that? Uh, I'm not sure either. But what I do know is that Halloween, the word, comes from an old English word expression, All Hallows' Eve, which just means All Saints' Eve. Now, we know Eve is like, you know, Christmas Eve is the day before Christmas. So Halloween, or All Saints, All Hallows' Eve is the day before All Saints' Day. And in the Christian calendar, All Saints' Day is when we celebrate the lives of all those great Christians that have gone on to heaven before us, and we remember them and we honor their memory. So this week, when you have the opportunity to dress up and go trick-or-treating, have fun, be safe. But don't forget that the day after All Saints Day, November 1st, is a day when we celebrate and remember some very, very special people that have gone on before us to heaven. Let's pray together. Lord God, we thank you for Halloween, that we can have fun and get some candy. Um, we pray, Lord, that you'll keep all of these children and youth safe in their Halloween activities. And help us also never to forget that we are the very next day remembering some very special people who have gone on before us. Bless all the children and youth of our church and community and all those watching this video today. Keep them safe and bless their families. In Jesus' name, amen.